A D S R Pro. Hi guys, welcome back to ADSR Pro with me, Mike Smith. Today we're looking at the freshly released uh, craft app from Modal. Um, basically, this is for the little Modal craft synth, and eventually we've got the Windows application, which we've been waiting for for a long, long time. So all I thought I would do is just quickly give you an overview of uh, the craft app itself. And then in the near future, I'll once I've spent a bit of time with it, I'll do some more videos. Um, so basically, as you can see, here it is in front of you. Um, so you've got two screens. You've got a live screen, which basically represents the craft app itself with the encoders and the two pages, which is basically like the front end of the, the actual synth itself. And then we've got some envelope presets. So we can also click back here and go to the editor. And there you've got your basic setup. So you can choose which MIDI channel. In this case, I'm using MIDI channel one. And I've updated it to the current version of 1.1. So check for updates. It's a really simple process to update your craft app to the latest firmware. So check for updates. Obviously, it'll tell you that there's a new update and it'll give you on screen instructions of how to um, basically update it took me no more than a minute so click settings again and we're back to our main screen and what we can do is we can flick through the patches here in the center so same again it shows you like it would do on the front screen of the craft app which preset you're on represented by the little four LEDs so there's five six seven etc so let's stick to our user patch and what we've got is our different oscillators so let's turn the mix down and we can change the octaves So there you go, there's the oscillator section. We've then got the filter envelope section, and as you'd expect, attack, decay, sustain, release. And same again, we've got the amp envelope over here, as you'd expect again, attack, decay, sustain, and release. Here's your filter cut off with the resonance. And again, you can just click and drag. And you've also got Morph. So you can Morph between a low pass and a high pass. Really nice. And you've also got your LFO section, which we can choose our different destination. In this case, cut off. Let's put an amount on. Any different shapes. And at the bottom here, you've got your effects section. So, distortion. Bit of delay. Tune and glide. And then if we go to the let's go to the section and again there's your envelopes but what there is in this is some envelope presets which 
which I think is really, really nice. And you've got your modulation wheel destination. Pitch bend. And back to the editor. So there you go. That's just a quick, quick overview of the new modal craft, uh, craft app for Windows. Uh, I'm on Windows 10, installed, no problem, runs fine. So, hope you found this useful. If you've got any questions, please do drop me a line. And until next time, bye-bye. A-D-S-R-E